I'm the first one here, Cindy and my realtor is showing up shortly. So this is the first house we're gonna look at in this entire process of home buying. First house. It didn't take as long as I thought, but it's been four weeks since we were waiting for the letter. We got the letter this morning for our pre-approval. So we started the home search the day we got it. I'm not playing games. I'm pressed. I want a house. So look at this home and now take a look at this backyard. This backyard though? My God, so big. It's time to take the first step. We've been talking about a house. We've been saving money. It was just been like, okay, well, it's time to get out of this place we are now. I was like, well, we're going to save money for the summer, all summer, and then we're going to start the process beginning of fall. So it was just time to start the process. So honestly, I didn't have any feelings when I fill out the application. Okay. So when you found, so how long did it take us to get approved? Oh my God. <laughs> Too long. Get approved or get pre-approved? Pre-approved. Pre-approved. Okay, okay, okay. So it took a while, right? Like the a pre, getting pre-approved, it was such, it was so many steps. And it's like, you got to do this, you got to do that. Um, so we was just, you know, and even after we got pre-approved, it was like, you pre-approved now, but you still have to do these things to get the loan approved. So that process was just, it was, my nerves were like, it's always up and down. See, if you see this, it's in the basement. Say that again for the people on the camera. This right here? Uh-huh. If you see something like this, mm -hmm. this is actually um, covering a load-bearing wall. Okay. All the load-bearing part of the structure, so it's... A basement area, if you see it's that. It's like you never know what else they're going to request from you. You never know. They can tell you, um, oh, this is fine, but then it turn around, you need something else. So it took a while. Honestly, I don't remember exactly how many days it was, but we, we got our pre approved. A month. <laughs> we got our, we, well, fine. Yeah. So it's, it was a process. It was, pro uh, it was long. It was definitely a long process. Okay, so what was the what was the first thing we did when we got pre approved? Went to the houses. So this is the two car garage that Cindy and I requested. I get, if you get this out, I get this out. I don't care. <laughs> cool. Cool story, bro. We had the second house. I don't turn this around. I can't so Wow, the first day of house shopping, of course, we, um, we, because I feel like we had some, you know, things in mind we wanted the house to have, so we went to look at houses. We looked, how many houses we looked at? Um, we looked at a lot of houses that day, um, and the first house oh, was not, day. maybe like six or seven that day. Yeah, we looked at, I think that was the most houses we looked at in one day, um, and I think out of all those houses, we didn't really like any of them. Um, in oh, hindsight, yeah, that first one, we could have bought that house, actually. Um, but we didn't really like any of those houses. It was like, uh, no, 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 no. Um, we wanted, like, two-car garage. We, we wanted um, a basement or we wanted, like, extra rooms because our original idea was to put an Airbnb in the house. Mm -hmm. um, and we changed that idea now, but... Those were the things we were looking at. So hindsight, the first, first house we looked at. And honestly, we would not have gone with the first house. Because how do we take the first thing? We should have went with the first but, one. And it wasn't like, oh my God, this first house is the, is, we didn't even feel like it was the house. So I can see why we didn't go with the first house. I think that that house we put the offer on, on that we didn't take. Yes, we're property number three. Number three. We started the house process in October. So October, November, December. So over two months. It took us over two months to actually find a house. And well, we did find a house prior to before I left for Florida. Because I remember before 
because I was leaving for Florida. I was going to be in Florida for a week. And it was very important that we find a house before I go. So, guys, we are at the fourth property because we couldn't get into the third one. So, I just want to show you how it looks when we pull up. And so, this is a split level home, I believe. So, we're going to go inside and check it out. It's getting a little dark outside, so it's going to be a little dark in here. Because when I come back, it was going to be the holidays. Um, and we needed to make a decision on the house. We need to start this process and thank God that we did find a house, but we did find a house that we absolutely love. And I would say that was a week prior to the house we buy now. Yes. Um, and that house was amazing. You guys, it yes. was absolutely beautiful. Three extra rooms that we, this one just couldn't live without. We practically was buying, uh, was that having six bedrooms? That was mm -hmm. three downstairs mm -hmm. and three upstairs. upstairs. Um, those extra rooms were going to be magic and, and it had a two car garage and it had a two. The house had everything we wanted. There was no compromising with that. House. There was no compromise. The house was perfect and the house was beautiful. It was big. So heading downstairs. <laughs> What the fuck is that? <laughs> In the the, we had a big living room. <laughs> we had a large backyard. We had an open kitchen. Um, the bedrooms that you was going to get the bedroom where you can open the wall. And I like, put a door there. Um, the house was perfect, really. And of course, that house did not accept our offer. Um, and they were not paying for closing calls. Um. What you guys say to the camera? Get your ass up. Go look at the rooms. So I'm going. All right. So we're looking at our sixth house in the journey of this process of trying to buy a house. So this is a one car garage. So this is the second house of the day in our process. So. Let's walk in and see what it's like. Ooh. It was just, it was kind of, it was already a little, the house itself was a, a little over, over the budget. budget. Yeah. And on top of it, they were not paying for closing costs. And I think if they were paying for the closing costs, it would have went up. That's perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. um, but not paying the closing costs and went up, which, you know, down payment would have went up. Um, but who knows? Doing the inspection, appraisal, it could have went down. Who knows? But that house was perfect. But then that's fine because we actually, the following week, we find our current house, which we love, yeah. which we absolutely love. It's big. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And this one trying to downplay how big it is. So we are at the first house and only house we're going to look at on this Sunday. I had to come by myself because. My realtor said this house will not last on the market, so we have to come look at it now. So we came to look at it now. So this is the neighborhood. It's pretty cool and laid back and chilled. So let's see when we can get in and you'll see more guys. The house is big, the living room, not so much. That's a lot. The living room is <laughs> nice size. The house is beautiful. It's definitely a great first house. Um, it has pretty much have two levels. Um, I get my room is upstairs. Kirk can get the whole bottom floor, let me tell you. Um, Kirk can get like two rooms downstairs. He's on bathroom. Thank God. Oh, my God. Ah, Listen, no one wants to share God. with her anyway. <laughs> It's all good. It's no, I don't have to be screaming. Put the fucking seat down. Okay. No one. No one wants to be screaming that all day. But so I'm I'm excited for our house. It's not it's beautiful. It's big. Um I can't wait to put a studio in the house. That is the first, first thing, thing on the list. First thing on we the list. All know. You guys, I'm so excited. I can't wait to bring my clients to work at the house. I can't wait to not have to leave the house and I'm I'm just excited. I feel like my emotions, my feelings, how I truly feel is now coming in now that 
not only are we closing We're tomorrow, closing um, not only are we closing tomorrow, we also, um, we, we're just excited. <laughs> we just we got our um close what is it um clear close yesterday and that was the moment I was like it's real it's happening she didn't believe um, it was real not that I didn't believe it was real it was she like, didn't believe it y'all I knew it was real it's been real since I started but it's always something so it's like because Vince was who was supposed to close last Friday um so it's always something they always asking for something else. So it hasn't been real to me. To me, honestly, it's I think it's still not gonna be like real, real, real when the key is in my hand. <laughs> and I, but when I, the feeling, the moment when she called me and said you are clear to close, I was like yes, and I screamed. I was like, alrighty. So, oh, this is our first home owned by Zillow, guys. So, <laughs> right. So this is the property. I love out here. I don't like there's a sewer thing right there. But this looks nice. It does look clean. I would like a larger driveway though. Can I make my own driveway? Yeah, all this space to the left. So here we are in the first room of the house. What is it called? Dining room. Dining room with carpet. Exciting. Kirsten came. He was very excited. Um, ah! <laughs> so this process just been, it's been, it's been an up and down thing. It's like. It, it takes you on an emotional roller coaster. It does. It does. Like one moment you feel good with what's, what's happening. You feel like you're doing your part. You on top of it all, and then the next they ask you to do this, do that, and it's like, but I already did so much, and you have to do some more. The other houses we're gonna to tour to one car garage, split level home. So let's get ready to go in, and it's an open door, so we're excited because now we learn we can come look at these homes on our own. So, and you will get good news followed by bad news. You will get it's like okay. So it's been it's been it's been a journey and um we learned so much though. So this is the house that we feel has the most potential out of any of the houses we've ever gone to. So I want to show you guys the upstairs. So this is what it looks like when you come in. Yeah, but they're big. So this is our, I don't know, 20th, 25th house. It has a one car garage. Clearly we've already given up the idea of having a two car garage, but it does have a really big extra space. We are looking at our new house again, so we'll know how to remodel and decorate. Is that what we're looking for, new house? No, we also look at our new house because we want to see how pretty it is. <laughs> we miss the house. People, I'm sorry to this people. I don't know who they is. They could be walking down the street right now. I wouldn't even know who they is. They come from behind the garage. It don't look like they ever had one. And even as far as it, it's just, it's a lot. It's a lot. It's, a lot. it's so, but it's amazing. I wouldn't change this. Okay, maybe I'll change some things. <laughs> I would educate myself more. I will definitely do a lot more Google because I feel like I did some Google, but I was like Googling from the, what I needed to do. Not too much so what to um like even listen definitely definitely um it was a lesson it was it's a lot it's a lot so i'm excited okay well thank you so much for telling us about the process 
And you guys are going to see this beautiful video.